Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Dodger Wolf with 504 rating versus Fruit Loop Troop with 411 rating, so it's going to be another high rated DB video, and let's hop right in. We're going to go ahead and see Fruit Loop Troop win the Rock, Paper, Scissors shoot, and they'll go first, 40 versus 40, gotta love to see it. Opening hands, we have Seer, Ancient Cloak, Fog Blade, Graph, and Boots, so... Hey, if you open up both BAs, you know, they kind of work together. But no going second cards here. They have Union Hanger, Unauthorized, BA, and Griffin. So this is the Brave Token ABC deck. Um, they're going to go ahead and activate Hanger. Oh, wow. Someone that's not pure playing this deck. It's kind of wild. Uh, they're going to go grab C. Let's see. Can they make pure proud? Normal Summon, Hanger Effect. Go ahead and equip Driver from the deck. And then, I like how they said Think, but like... There's, like, if you actually had a response to this, like, you would just do it, you know? Um, go ahead, driver, driver effect, get rid of itself, and then it's going to bring out C, and then C effect to bring itself out, get rid of those, go for gadget, and then they're going to activate C and B effect. So B go search for B, and then C to special summon out A, gadget effect to special summon out from the hand, and then it's going to bring out C, uh, get rid of those, go for IP, then they're gonna activate C effect and A effect. So A will go ahead and add back C, and then C will special summon out B, and then banish ABC, go for ABC Buster Dragon, B effect to equip, so that way it's not unaffected by spells, or opponent spells, I should say, um, which is actually gonna like come up here because they're gonna go end phase, activate unauthorized, and then target, equip A, so now it's unaffected by monsters, or opponent's monsters, um, you definitely want to hold that there because if they like nib you like you set this and they drop nib like that's huge So you just hold this if they ever like try nibbing you you just go ahead and do it uh, Like chain to make this unaffected and then pass draw stained So they're gonna activate graph effect special summon that out and then They're gonna go battle phase Okay, so when they say battle phase they activate the IP effect um, that is, I'm going to go ahead and IP, get rid of those, go for Appalooza, and then Seer Effect to try to special summon itself out, and they let this go through, okay, and then they're going to overlay, go for Break Swords, like if you negate Seer, they go Battle Phase, Grab Tread beating over, I guess you just banish then... So they'd have to do it a little bit differently. They could normal summon Seer and go battle phase and try just like raiding over with both. And then you can't like ABC out one. Or you can't out both. So like Appalooza for sure gets beat over. Uh, the Appalooza negate break sword effect to pop. Special summon out boots. Stained effect to try to summon itself out. They're thinking here. And they're going to let it go through. Which is fair enough because if you keep a negate on Appalooza, it means they have to go to battle phase to out it. Which means Appalooza acted as a threatening roar. Which is good. And then battle phase, break sword. Um, go ahead and attack over that. And then main phase 2, make break sword. Break sword effect. They're going to detach, targeting the fog blade and the A assault core. Um, then they're going to... I was going to say, I think that was like a little misclick there. They were just trying to send it to Graveyard. They might have been, uh, like if they had other stuff in Graveyard, you know, they could have like declared it to add back if they wanted to. Uh, then they're going to go for Zeus. Um, yep, then activate Zeus effect to go wipe. Chain ABC Buster. Target Zeus. Chain ABC Buster to tag out to Special Summon. Yo, this is going to be a pretty big chain link if they want it to be. Uh, they're going to activate B chain link 1, A chain link 2, B chain link 3. Yeah. So all those effects trigger there. Um, yeah, also hanger does go. Also, you know, Zeus wipes everything. Uh, and then they're going to go ahead, search, search, add back. And then fog blade, banish the special summon. Oh, and that's going to special summon out Stain, and they can just normal summon out Ancient Cloak and continue to play here. Go for Cherubini. Cherubini effect, dump Torn Scales, Ancient Cloak, Banish, go grab Shade. They're going to activate Shade, turn those into Rusty. Rusty effect to go ahead, dump Ragged Gloves, set Fog Blade, and then Ragged Gloves. Banish to go dump, dump Wings. Torn Scales effect, special summon itself out, and they're going to activate Wings. Banish, summon out the Boots. 
Overlay those, go for Sea Dragon, Sea Dragon effect, attach, special summon out, Ancient Cloak, effect, make Rusty gang 800, and then proceed to get rid of those to summon Anaconda, Anaconda, Dumb Fusion Destiny, and the Bricks, summon out the Enforcer, and then Banish Boots, go search Fog Blade. Set Fog Blade and pass. So, ending with a good amount of follow up, few interruptions, pass, draw prosperity. So, they are going to start this off by activating the prosperity to go banish. Oh, uh, they're going to banish six here Cerberus, Underworld, Lina, Unicorn, Hip, and Clarushka. And then look at the top six. So we see Temple, Imperm, Right, Ash, Valor. Ooh, this is an interesting choice, this format. Um, they're going to grab the Temple there, though, and then put the rest back to the bottom of the deck. And then they're going to activate Temple Effect, go search out Right, and then activate Right, Special Summon out the token, and then bring out the Fateful. Griffin Effect to try to Special Summon itself out. Um, they're going to Chain Enforcer. And then Enforcer will now go ahead and pop the Anaconda and the Fateful, summon that out. Okay, uh, they could have also popped the token. That would have shut off like the Griffin Negate while also like shutting off like the Equip spell that this would go search. Then they're gonna normal summon out C, uh, get rid of those, go for Nightmare Phoenix. C effect and Nightmare Phoenix effect. Go ahead, pop Fog Blade. C, bring out A. On resolution, banish Fog Blade. Summon out Break Sword. Rusty effect to pop. Rusty, pop Nightmare Phoenix. And then get rid of those two. They do not have anything to link into here. They did get rid of a few of their Link 2s, like the Lina, the Cerberus. Set question mark. No more Link 2. Fair enough. Uh, go ahead, banish. Summon out ABC Buster. Banish, summon out, wait, hold on, they, yeah, they still have, I was going to say, they, they have enough to summon the other one, they just banished the wrong one on accident, uh, summon out the ABC Buster, and then Battle Phase, oh no, something on Declaration, oh no, you let Peer down, you let Peer down so hard, Oh no, not like this. So this has 29 attack, correct? Because it's gaining 800 from Ancient Cloak. This is losing 400 from the hero. My monster is 3k, read DP. Oh, they admit the fee. Oh, not like that. Not like this. <laughs> wow, that's actually an insane win on Phantom Knight's part for not having like going second cards. Uh, next opening hand, we got Boots, Celestial, Droplet, Rota, Called By. Oh. This card is insane against ABC. They go ABC Buster Effect. Target your monster to go banish. Chain Effect Attack Out. You go, think. Chain Called By. And you just win. Simple as that. You just win. They have Nib, Hanger, Lancia, Right, Griffin. Oh, they open Griffin again, by the way. But, ooh, opening up two starters there. Plus, pretty good hand traps. Um, They're going to activate Right. And then right, we'll go ahead, special summon out the token, bring out the Fateful, uh, and then activate Griffin to special summon that out, and then they can activate Fateful effect to go search, so Fateful will now go ahead and grab the Equip spell. I wonder if uh, they're doing anything cool with these. I don't think they would, I feel like they would just leave them on board. Uh, they're going to go grab the B-Buster Drake. Normal summon, Hanger effect, go ahead, equip the driver, you know, very standard ABC stuff. Union Driver is so good for this deck, like, without Driver, oh my gosh, the deck would just have to be played so differently. Um, you're going to activate Faithful to go search out Temple and then discard. Uh, so grab Temple, discarding, not Temple, discarding the Draco back, okay. Uh, Draco back effect, equip to the token, get rid of those, go for Platinum Gadget, and then they're going to activate B effect to go search out the A here. Gadget effect, a special summon out A. So now they have all three pieces. They're going to special summon out Temple because they control the token. Go for the IP. Banish Temple, go search right. They haven't used that yet because they started off with just like hard activate right. Then banish ABC, bring out 
ABC Buster, and then Pass. Okay, I mean, those are really good end board. Lancia, Nib, ABC Buster, IP, Griffin. They draw another droplet. Uh, they're going to go ahead and activate Rota. Rota will go search. They're going to droplet for three. So ABC Buster, IP, and Griffin. Yeah. Um. Go grab Torn Scales, Normal Summon, Special Summon, Overlay for Break Sword, Battle Phase, Attack. Uh, has 2,000 defense. And then there's going to Main Phase 2, Downer Zeus. They have now summoned 5 times. They're going to activate the effect to go wipe. And then in response, they're going to chain the ABC Buster to tag out. But you actually can't attempt to Special Summon 3 monsters while you only have 2 zones. So that is actually an illegal activation. They were just trying to do that so that way the uh, the nib token would have less attack, like worse stats on it. But you actually cannot do that. Um, so summon that out, pass over. But we don't see Dodger Wolf catch that either. Resolution, Lancia, chain called by, go ahead, smack that. And they have Phantom Knight stuff. Wow. And they don't have the fault. Oh my bro. Dodger Wolf really just made this man look. Oh, Yo, that's not even how you spell it. Um, yeah, okay, fair enough. Uh, misclick. Um, <laughs> said little GGs. Yeah, at least someone said, G yo, I'm, oh my gosh. Yo, this player just got hard waxed. Hard waxed. I don't even know why they dropped Nib there. There was no point of dropping Nib in response to Zeus effect. Like, you know how they changed ABC Buster effects so that way the stats would be less on it? Wouldn't you just let Zeus wipe and then afterwards drop Nib if that's what you wanted? So that way, like, the stats on it are less? And at the same time, like, oh my gosh. Yeah, this player did not represent pure 555 five, five in a good way you know pure i'm not gonna lie pure would have found a way to win game one they're 100 i mean it, well it couldn't even that hard of a game to win let's be honest they for some reason nightmare phoenix targeted fog void when they knew that berkshire was in the graveyard so like kind of set themselves up for that just maybe you just like unicorn a back row summon access code they fog blade it you're like cool fair enough um if you want to you could like Use access code banish itself to pop rusty. You don't even need to do that though. And you have like ABCs coming out. Like, I don't know if they actually would have been able to win that game one. I don't know. It would have been cool to see uh, Pierre play it and how they would decide to do everything. Um, this turn was, oh my gosh, played horribly. They were like, oh, I opened three interruptions on field plus Nib Lancia. Oh, I win. But then Dodger Wolf was like, no, you don't. <laughs> no, you don't. Not today. Not today. You know, find out why they call me the Phantom Knight God. You found out. You find out. But, yeah, um, seeing how long that match was. Yo. 37 minutes. That kind of felt like a sweep. But, I guess there had to have been a lot of thinking on both sides. But, hopefully we get to see Fruit Loop Troop on the channel in the future. Hopefully they learn how to play their deck better by then. Uh, I mean, like, you know, no, no offense to them, but like, hopefully they they do because like they that 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 was winnable. That that was really winnable. I don't know why they dropped nib. They're like, oh Zeus, nib nib gotta drop nib gotta drop nib. But there was just no need for it. Um, yeah. And with all of that being said, the DB Grinders signing off. Peace. Have a nice day. Stay safe.